Hey, how's it guys? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use VBA to encrypt your PDF files. Before diving into the tutorial, you'll need to download this encrypt PDF.exe file. And this is a command line tool that I created using Python to encrypt a PDF file with a password. Alright, so here's my Excel spreadsheet. In column A, I have the file path to uh, these three PDF files. And column B are the password that I want to uh, embed to the PDF files. So make sure that you make a backup of your PDF files before you run the macro. Alright, so here let me open the VBA window by going to the Developer tab. And click on Visual Basic to launch the VBA window. I'm going to insert a new module. Inside the module, I'm going to create a subroutine. And I'll name the macro equip PDF. Actually, PDFs. And I'll declare my variables first. File name as string. And it's going to be row number as long. And last row as long. And to reference to the worksheet, I'm going to name the object WS list based on the worksheet name as worksheet object. And those are the variables and objects that I need to declare. Right, so here let me create my Wushi object first. I'm going to type set ws list is equals to this whole book that wishes and giving the Wushi name. And I'm going to insert a with statement followed by the Wushi list object. Inside the with statement, I want to grab the last row first. And I'm going to type last row is equals to dot sales. Inside the sales method, I want to type rows count based on count a dot m excel up dot row. And this will return the uh, last row number based on count a. Now I need to insert a loop to iterate each item in count a. So I'm going to say that for row number, it's going to be from row 2 to last row. And here let me open up the PDF file. And I can confirm that when I open the PDF file, there's no password protection. Now going back to the Fibre script. Now what we need to do here is we need to run the command line using the shell script. So I'm going to type code shell followed by the program name. And I'll go back to my project folder. I'll simply copy the program name, encrypt pdf.exe. And it's going to be the program name. And we need to insert space after the program name. Then I want to insert the file path. And because uh, my file path has an uh, empty space between some of the folder name, so I need to wrap the uh, folder name with a double quotation. And to do that, I'm going to use the char function and the uh, double quotation character code is going to be 34. Then I want to join the character with the uh, folder path. And to get the folder path, we're going to type that cells, giving the row number from count A, that value. Now we need to insert the closing double quotation. Right, so this is going to be the uh, file path. And the second argument is going to be the password. Essentially, using the program, you just need to provide the file name followed by the password that you want to embed to the PDF file. Between the file path and the password, we need to insert a space followed by a double quotation followed by the password. And it's going to be closing double quotation. And for the window style, we can uh, use VB normal for this. Oops, here, close parenthesis. And finish the uh, statement. And this is everything we need to write for the VB script. Now save the file. Now I want to go to my express sheet. I want to go to View, Macros, 
and I'll run the encrypt PDF files macro, run it. And here I'm getting the, oh, this should be last row underscore row. Right, so here let me stop the operation. Oops, here let me I'll open the folder again. Now let me go back to my spreadsheet. Under view, macros, and I'll run the macro again. And I'm getting the last row. Oh, here I'm going to just copy paste the variable name. All right, so let me run the macro one more time. Now it's going to launch the uh, command line window. Basically, uh, it's an indication that the command line tool is encrypting the PDF files. And it looks like the procedure is finished. Now if I double click on the PDF file to open the file. Now it's going to prompt me to enter the password. And I'm going to go back to my spreadsheet and I'll copy the, the password. And I'll copy and paste. Okay, so I don't think I can copy and paste. So I need to merely type the password. And it's going to be HP123. And enter. And I'll unlock the file. Now let me try a different file. So it's going to be the second file. And this one is going to be the last file. And the password is going to be 12345. So I'll enter 12345. And enter. And I'll unlock the PDF file. So this is everything I want to share in this video. And hopefully you guys found this video useful. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.